guys good morning and welcome to another video welcome to my channel if you're new to my channel my name is joy i will keep on mentioning my name because i know i do get a few people who drop by who join this family so you're highly highly welcome if you're new to this channel and to all my returning subscribers you are highly welcome as well you guys thank you for watching this video and welcome to another vlog it's a new day it's a beautiful day it's a weekend and i'm so happy <laughs> look at me putting on even makeup eh? <laughs> i hardly put on makeup but today i just put on my tiny tiny whatever makeup because i am just happy that i'll be going out you guys if you have watched my other video i think the video my lockdown life in canada where i was just complaining how moody i feel because of this whole lockdown thing but thank god they've lifted some of the um some of the restriction not not in toronto though in toronto we're still in lockdown but in our neighboring city i live in the boundary of toronto and another city so that city is open for business so today i am just so excited i'm going to be going to the store today i'll be going to ikea i'll just be going to ikea to browse around and see what what is there i know that i need one particular thing <laughs> this is plant i love to have a plant in my house uh you've seen some of the videos or you've seen some plant green plant in my house in some of my videos but my children destroyed it the plant has been dying like struggling because i, I think it's not getting enough sunlight but i just came home one day i left my kids I came home and they destroyed it like it's completely dead it's just not looking good anymore so i'm just going to go there and see what they want now i'm even tired of buying real plants because it dies every now and then like very often it dies so i'm looking for i'm looking for artificial plant i will go to ikea and see if they have artificial plant if they do i'm probably going to pick up one there i'm looking for something big you know what so that's what is going to be a vlog it's going to be an interesting vlog <laughs> hopefully you'll see this vlog sooner than later sometimes i make my vlog and it takes a long time for me to even post it put everything together and post it but hopefully you're going to see this one sooner than later so finally guys i made it to ikea ikea is very beautiful if you see the lineup i wasn't able to actually take a picture of the lineup well the lineup was like about 20 minutes to get in I guess a lot of people like me, we are tired of being stuck at home and everybody just wanted to come out too. So finally I'm here, I'm going to just go look around, even though I came for one thing but you know when you come to Ikea, you can't just go straight to what you came to buy, you have to go through a maze, go through the whole store before you come out to the other end and there, this is just Ikea, there's always a display. They display everything so you can see how it looks and this is a, a kitchen a minimalist minimalistic kitchen or whatever so i guess the idea not i guess it is the idea that by the time you walk around to get to what you want to buy you might have found something else to buy so you come and you look at all the beautiful stuff there's no way that you will not be tempted to buy something else so I'm just gonna make my way and IKEA is big. This particular IKEA is big. So you have to go through the winding ways to get to where you're going. If you see something you like, this is the couch section. So here they have all sorts of couch on display. So you can't just pick it up from here. You have to go to the downstairs where you pick up anything you see this is just the display room the upstairs the, down, the upstairs are the display room and then when you go to downstairs that's where you can pick up whatever you want to buy i know it might be hard for you to hear me because i'm wearing a mask so i might be sounding a little bit muffled so every time i see a kitchen i must stop so here is another kitchen still like here here's this one a smaller kitchen and then you come on this side okay. do you like this kitchen tell me which one is your favorite 
Which of these kitchens are your favorite? So this one is a combination of a kitchen and a dining room. See, I'm just looking. Oh, this is this looks like the plant that I want to come and pick up. So when I get to the plant, which is exactly what I came for, I'll show you. But this one is nice too. I like this. It's a big kitchen with an island. This this will be my dream kitchen with a big island. A deep sink. Look at the sink. Well, the sink is not too deep, but the sink is very modern. But I don't like the the cooking top. Actually, this is the cooktop. I wouldn't like this type of cooktop. I would prefer like a gas, a gas stove. And look at that one over there. That one has a gas stove, the blue one. And that one is much bigger. So yeah, I prefer that one. But I like some features in this one as well. So you see, this looks like a Toronto apartment. A tiny, tiny city apartment. This is the balcony. And then you go from the balcony into the kitchen. This is well, the balcony is not obviously how you get in, but this is what the kitchen looks like. And this is again, this is just a display. This is the kitchen, and on this side is the living room. This is the living room, and then you go. <laughs> And then you go this way, that's the bathroom as you can see, the bathroom. It's a compact kitchen, I must say, it's a very very compact kitchen. So finally, finally I have made my way to the garden section, the plants. So these ones are the fake plants, which is the one that I want to buy. This one is not big, as big as the one I want. But well, this one looks very, very real. I'm telling you. You won't even know that this is fake plant. I really like this one, but the one over there is the one that I want because it's bigger. So yeah, this one, this is the one that I want. This one. Even this one, you can hardly tell that this is fake. No, I want this one. That one doesn't have a lot of leaves, so my husband was touching that one. But I prefer either this one or this one. But I, this is the one that I want. See, look at both of them. This one looks a little bit big. The palm one looks too big, doesn't it? Like the, the leaves. I like this one better. At least when I have it, I know it's not going to die. It doesn't need any sunshine. <laughs> it doesn't need any... <clears throat> any water, any nutrient, any maintenance. I buy it once and then I'm done. They don't even have the other ones, the fresh ones. They don't have those ones. They only have this fake one. Before, normally, normally when you come to Ikea, you have the option of these fake ones or the real ones. So down there is where they normally have the real ones, but I guess because they just opened, right? they just opened like a week ago, they haven't had the opportunity to make the real, to, to bring in the, the real ones but this this was where I bought the other one that is dead now so I'm just gonna pick up one and then uh, I'm going to go I'll show you guys when I get home see whenever I'm going out with them whenever you go outside with them I don't know for some reason they just don't like to walk it's running so look at them A break for what? Can we take a break? Like, stay here and then later we can keep on running. Yeah, why do you guys run actually? Why are you guys running? Because it's very fun and that's exercise that we want to be strong. <laughs> that's why we always run. It looks so sunny and it looks so beautiful. This is past 4 o'clock, going to 4 30, going to 5. It looks so sunny, but don't let the sun deceive you. It's still a little bit cold. It's not as cold as yesterday. Yesterday was, in the morning, it was like minus, minus 18 degrees. It was very cold in the morning. But it's still cold. Today, it's just, it's about 6 degrees, 6 degrees Celsius. So when I say my degrees, I always use Celsius, not Fahrenheit. 
Abigail, why are you sweeping the ground with your with your gloves? I just finished work and uh, I couldn't resist to come out to take to take in this nice beautiful sunshine that we have. Take it in while it lasts. Yeah, it's almost spring. It's almost spring. I can't wait. I can't wait for spring to come. Running and running and running. Maybe I'm I have a Usain boat. Are you guys going to grow up to be Usain boat? Victoria. Yes. <laughs> Do you know who Usain boat is? No. You don't. <laughs> Can you tell me? You want me to tell you who Usain boat is? Yes. Usain boat is the fastest runner alive so far. Do you know where he is from? Usain Bolt, he's from Jamaica. Is that <laughs> close to your country? No, it's close to your daddy's country. Oh. Yeah, Usain Bolt is from Jamaica. And he's very tall and very strong and very fast. I don't know the fastest woman alive. I don't know. Are you? Look at that big girl where she is. Look at her where she is. She's far away from where we are. And look at this one. Anyways. Sasa. So guys, I want to come here to end this vlog. This vlog has taken me some time to actually compile it and edit it and put it up on YouTube. But finally I'm here and I want to come and end this vlog. But before I do so, I want to wish all mothers and mothers to be a very very happy and a wonderful mother's day yes it is no mother's day here in north america yet we do have our mother's day in the month of may somewhere in the month of may but it's always in the month of may that's when we have our mother's day here in north america but i know that in other parts of the world in africa and in nigeria especially they are celebrating mother's day today so Happy Mother's Day to all of you. Happy Mother's Day to all the wonderful women in my life. Very, very happy Mother's Day. And to my mom, I wish you a splendid Mother's Day. You've gone through a lot. You've gone through a lot to raise us. Especially with me, who have always been a sickling. I always fall sick. There's always something with me and my mom. She's just the best mom in the world. She's the best mom, the best friend that anyone can have and she had nothing she had nothing in her life so thank you mom i wish you a very very happy mother's day thank you to my aunt thank you to all other mothers in my life and all other mother figures in my life happy happy mother's day if you remember this song the song that i just played now it's a very very old song i cannot believe that i actually found this video this song on youtube but yes it tells you a whole lot of what mothers go through so celebrate all the mothers and mother figure in your life all right guys so while we were coming back from our trail our walk with my two girls my daughter she was asking me about coronavirus she was like mom is coronavirus ever going to end it doesn't seem like it's going to end she started counting the months that had gone by that we have been in a lockdown it just took me by surprise you know sometimes you don't actually know that this is affecting this coronavirus this lockdown and all the whole thing around the, this COVID-19 is affecting children it's actually affecting them we only know of, of us adults how it's affecting us or when we talk about how it's affecting about do check up on your loved ones especially your kids you know it's my it's affecting them psychologically or emotionally without you knowing and she was telling me like mom is is satan that brought this covid 19 because he he doesn't want the good people to be happy you know she was telling me all this thing i was like wow i was just listening to what she was saying listening to what she was saying i was assuring her no coronavirus is going to be over it is going to be over very very soon and thank god it is going to be over we are here in ontario you guys know that we've been in lockdown since 2000 and since 2020 december 26 but they have slowly slowly lifted up some of the lockdown here in toronto some of the we've gone from the red zone to the gray zone gray zone means that some things could open though other things like barbershop barbing salon 
and um, a whole lot of other things can still not open but majority of other things like the malls are open but at 25 percent capacity or so but at least we are getting there we're slowly getting there if everybody could do their own part we will be back to somewhere normal somewhere in quote normal to where things used to be but at least we are getting there but the, the point is just check up on your loved ones check up on your kids you know assure them that things are going to be all right every now and then even if you cannot take them to their normal normal life but take them outside so they can you know change the environment instead of just staying in the all the time go for a ride and just go to a different whole new environment if when we're going for a ride we go to a totally new environment so that we can experience, experience something new yes yeah, so guys so that brings me to the end of this vlog if you watch up until this point thank you so much for staying with me thank you for watching for always clicking and always watching please leave your comment in the comment in the comment section below give me a thumbs up if you haven't subscribed to my channel please do so you're going to love this channel i'm sure you did you not enjoy this vlog you're going to love i upload new videos on a weekly basis so you guys you can see my plan that's the new plan that's my artificial plant okay artificial plant and i bought from um, ikea it looks very very nice in the background i like it it looks very real it doesn't look like artificial plant but yes guys so until we see ourselves in the next video thank you stay safe and remain blessed bye bye